August 21st marks the first day of the fall semester at WKU, but classes won't begin until 4 o'clock that day so that thousands of students who live outside the line of totality can come to campus to witness the Great American Eclipse for themselves. Got the sun. Students at WKU Science Camp are practicing for August 21st. It was really cool. Like, I didn't think it would really work, but it did. It was really awesome. This year's camp focus, what else? The upcoming solar eclipse. This time, it had to be the theme. We didn't have a choice. The big difference is everyone was so excited. The buzz is getting louder about the August 21st total solar eclipse that will be visible from right here in Bowling Green. Hopkinsville gets about two and a half minutes. We get about one minute exactly to tell people that exit 28 on the interstate is outside totality exit 26 is inside it so if you live even a mile north of the totality line you will get a partial eclipse partial just doesn't count it just isn't anything close to the same thing that's why WKU is hoping to fill Smith Stadium with K through 12 students who live north of the total eclipse viewing area we are uh, extended an invitation to a variety of districts largely north of, of the totality line in the hope that they'll be able to send their students. So there are all these school districts just north of us that are at 99%. That's not where you want to be. It's literally the difference between day and night. An eclipse committee comprised of people across campus has been meeting for the past 18 months to work out logistics. We understand that this is an or, you know, organizationally challenging for you to do to send your students uh, off campus for a whole day. This is something they will remember for the rest of their lives and it's important that they've been provided the opportunity. T-shirts, posters and viewing glasses are already available to commemorate the event. This is the biggest in-your-face science experiment ever. Eclipse merchandise is already available at Design Tees in Bowling Green. To find out more about WKU's plans for August 21st, log on to wku.edu backslash eclipse. With this week's View from the Hill, I'm Amy Bingham.